Okay, guys. We moved from the pontoon. Got too dark, a little too weedy. We just did a round across the lake. I lost the lure, though, so now I'm on the chartreuse little thing. What? We need to not fish. For, like, we can't do it now. What we need to not fish for like a day. And, and or two days. That's why, that's probably why the fishing's so good. Because we took you a week on, we then off fishing. And fishing Let's go! Big in. Yeah! Guys doing pike. Yeah. I don't know. This doesn't look like a northern. Go get dad. I don't know. Go get dad. It's right there. Go get dad. Where? Right here. That's a northern. No, it is, but it isn't colored like a northern. Go get dad. It isn't, look though, it isn't colored like a northern. It's like blue and purple. Go white is. need his name up in lights. He just wants to be heard. Whether it's the beat of the mic. Feels so unlike everybody else alone In spite of the fact that some people still think that they know him But fuck him, he knows the code It's not about the salary, it's all about reality And making some noise, making a story Making sure his click stays up That means when he puts it down, tax picking it up Let's go Who the hell is he anyway? He never really talks much Never concerned with status So guys, I caught a blue northern My first one ever it's Right here, you can see the, the blue That's very blue right here I think we should let it go because it's about to die well, it's not. Picture. It's not gonna this die. This is called the Blue Northern. They're still even them starstruck. Humble through opportunities given despite the fact that many misjudge him because he makes a living from writing rats. Put it together himself. Got a picture connects. Never asking for someone's help or to get some respect. He's only focused on what he wrote. His will is beyond reach. And now it all unfolds. The skill of an artist. This is 20% skill. 80%. Hey guys, so it's two days after. No, two days after I caught my fish. And, or not my fish, my blue, nor, blue northern pike. But it isn't a blue northern pike. The blue northern pike were our blue walleyes, and they're thought to be extinct. In the Lake, lake Erie in the early 1900s, they were overfished and overkept. So they were, they, they were thought to be extinct because they caught them all. But they're actually coming back, and there's some still left today that you can actually catch up in like Canada and stuff. And they're only in the Great Lakes. You can't go catch them in like you're like in Minnesota. I guess you can. You you can catch them in the Great Lakes. Now you guys know that. Um, so mine are rare. And uh, Canadian researchers over 72 years sampled only 42 blue slash silver pike compared to the 19,378 normal pike. And uh, they have blue, beautiful iridescent blue silvery flanks. So, which mine had. It also says they have no body spottings, but by body spottings, I think, this is what I think, they mean, they mean like this. See how it's all white? And there's big body spottings. Mine, oops, mine had body spottings. You can see there's a very distinct black one right there, one right there, and then a couple up there that has body spottings. It just doesn't, um, uh, they just aren't as big and noticeable. Um, and the blue silver pike can only mate with other silver pike. And a normal pike then cross with a normal piker in hatcheraries. The result crosses with the particularly black molted markings like those found on a black crappie. So they are, they mate with those, so that's good. And the tips of the blue pike tails are significantly more pointed than those found on a northern pike. 
Um, and the record in Minnesota, the record solar pike is 18 pounds, 14 ounces, which is a lot. Mine was like three pounds, not even. So yeah, this one guy says all across Canada and from Montana to New York for more than 50 years. I've been fishing for like not even 10. 50 years I've only been in boats with two silver pikes that have been landed. And he's been conducting pike seminars throughout the same wide region. Which is weird because, gosh, 50 years, that's a long time. Anyways, so yeah. And my blue northern pike was 20.625 inches and it, the girth of it was um, 3.75. The bait I was using was the Chartreuse um, Spinner Bait. It was by Booya. It's the 3 16th ounce version. And if you want to go do more research and see the article that I found on, um, check the link in the description. So I'll see you next time on Sam's Fish Street. Thanks for watching.